85 to 89. Just missed it. I'm sorry? 80 to 85. Cool. Who are you with? I was with Second Battalion, Fifth Marines for the most part. Basically went boot camp to San Diego. Yeah. From there straight to the Philippines. Well, actually from there to ITS, yeah. Camp Pendleton. Yeah. Straight from there to the Philippines. Right. Did 14 months over there, came back, ended up in 2-5 in Camp Pendleton. Uh, Camp Margarita. Yeah, I was lucky because when I was in 2-5, yeah. we, we were on the amphibious assault team and stuff yeah. like that, so we did the, uh, basically six months on float, yeah. six months in Okinawa, yeah. um, because of a thing there, I got to go back to the Philippines for a couple of weeks, that was fun. Yeah, we did a fly out to Honduras, Alaska, went to Texas. <laughs> Which can be a different place, yeah. you know, I mean, it, it, it its own dictionary in some way, so, you know. Yeah, it's, you know, it, it was never anything big. The, the most action I've seen was, um, we were locked and loaded in Honduras, but didn't get to fire nothing. Yeah. Um, Philippines got shot at a few times. Well, yeah? Is there, is well, basically, uh, back then we didn't call them that. Basically, there were just radicals that wanted us off the base. Uh, Post 9, which is the farthest one away, yeah. is where they used to... The road is like 35 feet from the guardhouse. Yeah. So the guardhouse is riddled with bullets. <laughs> you know? Immediately. No so question. Aimed at the door. Aimed at the door. Yeah. With a loaded. Yeah, it's locked and loaded. Yeah, locked and loaded. Yeah. Everybody was carrying at least a shotgun. Mm -hmm. And a sidearm. HK5 and mm P5s -hmm. and 45s. Mm -hmm. So he goes through and he looks and he goes and takes the whole thing and they go through and they're like, just totally serious. I mean, no smiles, no nothing. He's not, I'm not going to use it. Right. So he goes back in and they go and they hear, choo, choo. Go to where the, the, the box is, mm -hmm. stop inside the box. So you walk down, there's a box. Choo, 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 choo. Passenger, proceed, even out the whole thing. Okay. Like all the way out, gets in, driver gets in. Everything is structured. Oh, yeah. You miss the structure, you're pulled out of line, yep. there's another set of guys that take care of you, and we screw with you the rest of the fucking day. Yep. <laughs> yeah. It was just it's, that it, way. When you're a Marine on post, nobody is above you. Mm -hmm. He was going to be afraid he was going to get the lieutenant and it was like, I'm an officer, you're an 
no reason to if they've got they've always got a place to detain you yep. and do it with you standing up yep. they'll put you into a wall but you know they don't have to put you on the ground no it, and it's one set of rules for everybody You want some? Go ahead. This Take one's not used. Away. Okay. Yeah, I always try to have some. I even have a oh, couple yeah, bottles in here way. for, you know, radiators. Probably and stuff. on a warm day. Not that warm, but. Well, nothing else. I've got a bottle just because, one, what happens if you break down? You're going to need it. Mm -hmm. Two, what happens if you get to spring a leak? Where you can at least yeah, I remember exactly. my bottle of gin. I just didn't bring my water. <laughs> but, you know, in a pinch. Different boiling point, yeah. Well, actually, you know what? On a hot day, the gin and the alcohol, and you can replace it work, really yeah. very effectively. Yeah. Because what is, what is the antifreeze doing for part of it is alcohol? Yeah, exactly. Different kinds. That's because it doesn't freeze. Yeah, yeah. So, you know, I mean, granted, Russians think it's the same, and some of them drink it after a while, but then they're not Russians anymore. So are you breathing okay now behind me? Oh, yeah, definitely. Yeah, no more smoke and anything like that. Have to take it back out of there. Yeah, you said you had an oil leak or something. It's a little leaky. Yeah. Where is it coming from? You know, the first 150 miles, it was dry as could be. Mm -hmm. Can you tell where it's coming no, from? No, I can't really. It looks like it's in the area of the head gasket. I used a really expensive chromatic metallic uh, metal head gasket. Right. Well, one with the, the, the metal ring and compression. Yeah. Did she didn't need a bump start or something? Huh? No, I think she was just on a hump and she couldn't get it. She couldn't push uh, it forward. That's when you start the engine. <laughs> I don't think she wanted to resort to turning the bike on just to be able to do a little boost. Right. Is that right? Is that right? I'm not totally useless. I can be used as a bad example. Cool. So we're going up Mount Herman to. Mm -hmm. Where are we going? Where? And then up, and then up what? Down into Scott Valley? Up, down, and sideways. Yeah, yeah that's up there, right? I think, this, I think this 
I'm not sure. <laughs> if you want me to lead you through part of it, I, I'm willing to do it if you want. Well, the route, the route that I, I posted, I think is right. I think it just is confused right now because I'm facing that way instead of facing that way. See, I don't have one of those new bagels. I don't have anything new. And I'll be looking for you and watching this and it'll never be amazing. So that every time I import, sometimes it overrides the article. Oh, right, right. So it ends up with goofy names on it. Those guys have it set to auto name, which was over the starting point. So if they start from the, the, the uh, big basin, you'll see the big basin, explanation mark, or multiple explanation mark. That happens because of the auto name. Oh, okay. If you named the darn thing, we wouldn't have that issue. Okay. Texas! Texas! 